Good morning, LG, and today is Tuesday, March 12th, 2024. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Place your right hand over your heart and face the flag. One, two, three. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Friends, please remain standing for the LGN Pledge. One, two, three. I respect myself and others too. I am responsible in all I do. I stay safe each and every day because that is the LGN way. We are respectful. We are responsible. We are safe. Little school, big heart. Friends, the wind has gone. Yesterday was pretty blustery, wasn't it? Yeah, it's super windy. Um, supposed to get warm today. Hopefully it'll be good. Hey, have you ever been in the car and you had like the the greatest playlist of songs come on randomly? That happened to me this morning. It made me really smile. And I was As I was driving over the bridge, over 495, I go back roads to get here from Mansfield. I saw the sun rising because of the time change. The sky was like this purplish reddish color and I had Paul Simon, I had Chris Stapleton playing, uh, The Killers, Human was on. It was awesome. It reminded me yesterday, I, I had a chance to talk with a third grader at recess, my friend Teddy and I, uh, in the midst of the soccer game, we stand kind of in the middle of the field, and if the ball comes to us, we kick it. Um, but generally, we just talk about music, because Teddy is super passionate about music, and he loves the band Kiss. And uh, so we have good conversations about that. Yesterday he was asking what the first album I bought was. And I think it was the first CD I bought anyway. Yeah, a CD. Um, was, I think, Elvis Presley Live at Madison Square Garden, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, I think I had some other records and things. I remember some Michael Jackson records, some Bruce Springsteen records, things like that. Um, but yeah, definitely Elvis Presley Live at Madison Square Garden. And Teddy was telling me about his first albums and that he... Loves to listen to records and, and, uh, he has a tape deck at home. So it made me smile because, uh, I love hearing about students' passions. So I'm wondering what your passions are. I know third graders are, are doing their passion projects, their expert fairs coming up in the spring. I can't wait to see what everyone is excited, um, to share with, with their families and their, excuse me, their teachers. Uh, so really cool stuff. Just made me think of that. Um, today, what do we got going on today? Not a whole lot, but, um, we do have our latest tasty tidbit today, so I'm going to turn turn that over in just a minute. I do have some GGs to deliver today, and because it is St. Patrick's Day on Sunday, we've got a very special St. Patrick's Day GG for you. All right, classes are doing an amazing job. I've got to move that GG in the cafeteria. I have to check with Mrs. Dietz about how far along we are, because I think it's pretty far. All right, friends, have a wonderful day. Keep working hard. Uh, rock out to music when you have a chance, maybe 30 second dance party. We had one of those in the office the other day for some students who were achieving at high levels. So uh, keep it up. We're proud of you. Have an amazing day. I'll see you around school today. Don't forget, Mr. Giz loves you. Rock on. Let's learn about healthy foods that help us grow. Tasty tidbits. Welcome, Welcome to Tasty, Tasty Tidbits. Tidbits. Today's tidbit is about a yummy seasonal vegetable, asparagus. They are nutrient-packed stocks full of vitamins and minerals. Asparagus has a funny shape. It looks like a little tree or a wand. Asparagus can be prepped in many ways, including steaming, grilling, roasting, or even pickling. It's a versatile vegetable that can be used in salads, stir fries, and much more. So long, long for tasty tidbits.